The great doctor, W.G. Grace, one of the outstanding cricketing characters of all time. W.G. Grace was the, the great phenomenon, really, of English cricket. Absolutely legendary character. He was one of the most famous people in the world, outshining even actors, actresses, politicians, even monarchs, maybe. Everyone knew who the great doctor was. W.G. was born in 1848, and when he started, Test cricket was 25 years away from beginning. He scored millions of runs, took lots of wickets on pitches that were simply awful. They were roads, really. When he first played Test cricket, that was 1880. He was 32 years old. Three brothers, W.G., E.M. Grace and G.F. Grace, all played in that Test match against Australia at the Oval in 1880. WG made 152 in the first innings. He was the most successful batsman of his era by distance. The bowl he could catch. And when you think uh, of the conditions in which he played and the runs he scored, it makes you realise why, if you pick the best side ever, WG, I think, as an all-rounder, has to be there. He played an extraordinary amount of time. I mean, he went on till past his 50th birthday by some distance. He was still playing first-class cricket. It was he who steered the game from its fairly humble rural beginnings. He was probably one of the world's great professionals too. He might have been an amateur technically, uh, but the fees that he commanded for his presence in places like Australia, on the tours of Australia, well that money would be worth an awful lot of money nowadays. But he was truly, I think, not only the start of English cricket in a funny sort of way, he was um, one of its greatest players. An innovative, outstanding cricketer.